Good morning, Aries. Talk about the baby box. Let's get into your daily reading, my lovelies. Hey, Aries, what do you need to know today? What does Aries need to know today? Thank you for all your likes, shares, and subscribes. Very much appreciated. What does Aries need to know today, please? Aries, you've got the Eight of Swords, the King of Swords, and the Three of Pentacles. Aries, you've got somebody here who can't stop thinking about you. You're living rent-free in their head. Uh, this could be Gemini, Libra, Crows, doesn't have to be, but this is somebody who wants a reconciliation with you. Crap on the Three of Pentacles, somebody just really wants to work with you here. Yeah, you've got the Ace of Cups, brand new beginning. Taking things slowly. Does this person know you? <laughs> Cross watchers, uh, Aries doesn't do anything slowly. We're fire signs. We like to do things quick. Why is the Knight of Pentacles here? Why is the Knight of Pentacles here? Nine of Wands. Ah, uh, because you guarded Aries. <laughs> Someone's trying to test the waters to see if, see if it's okay to, you know, come in, give you this cup of love to reconcile, to work with you. They see that you're you're protecting your energy, Aries. <laughs> Alright, uh, can I find the Eight of Swords? Why is this person thinking about you non-stop? Whoever this person is, they have finally found their strength and the courage to tell all. Okay, the High Priestess is now in the reverse. Um, this person probably wasn't using their intuition about you before. They're using their intuition now, but... Um, I've got the High Priestess in the reverse, because I'm hearing this person possibly got some bad advice about you. Or um, they were told stuff about you and now they can't know the truth. Hangman. They're seeing things from a different perspective. Who is this King of Swords? Who's King of Swords? Oh, that's why. This King of Swords, whoever they are to you, Aries, um, they're having to sneak away to come and see you. All right. I'm not seeing anything negative of the set of the Seven of Swords um, because it comes with, you know, balance and patience and the chariot. This person is having to sneak away to come and see you. Why are they having to sneak away to come and see you? Let's see. Let's clarify the Seven of Swords. Why is this person having to sneak away to come and see Aries? <laughs> okay, it's it's nothing bad, Aries. All right. Um, okay, so they're not sneaking away to come and see you. They're sneaking towards you, Aries, because they don't know how to approach you. They're coming through like softly, softly. Let's see if Aries is uh, is no longer mad because they want to take the leap of faith. Page of Wands. They're coming in, possibly a little bit immature, cheeky, is the word I'm getting. This person is coming towards you quite cheeky. Mischievous. They're a bit of a low key. And yes, they're waiting for their ships to come in with you, Aries, after some heavy burdens here. Ten of ones at the bottom of the deck. Okay, let's see, right, who is this person for Aries and what do they want? Who is this person for Aries and what do they actually want with Aries? Okay. <clears throat> they want to know all your secrets. It's come out again. You saw me shuffle the deck. Page of Swords, High Priestess, Temperance, Knight of Pentacles, and the Strength. Could be dealing with the Pisces, the Sagittarius, and Leo. What do they want with you? They want to take things slowly. Okay. This person's a little bit egotistical. They want to know all your secrets. With the Page of Swords and the High Priestess, they want to know what you're up to. Let's see what action. What action is this person going to take towards Aries today? This is a timeless reading, though, so this could happen at any time. What action is this person taking towards towards Aries. They're actually coming towards you. They're not walking away. They're coming towards you because they see you as Queen of Pentacles. Okay. Uh, they could be going through a little bit of karma right now. They want to turn this thing up. All right. They may want to bring you justice. Could be a Libra. But clarify the Eight of Cups. Yeah, they are trying to come, come towards you softly, softly because... Aries, you walked away from them. You possibly fell out of love with them. 
Right, it's this King of Cups Aries. They think you have options, Aries. Whether you do or not. Yeah, they... they <laughs> Aries, they could have been told that you had options. By someone. Whether you do Aries or not, I don't know. But something came to light towards them and now they think you don't love them. Okay. Aries, what is your action towards this person? Aries, your action towards this person. You'll welcome them in. You will. Yeah. Your action towards them. Victory and success. A, a double victory. I think you will hear them out. I think you do have love for this person. I was just thinking, at this moment in time, there may not be communication between you two, but I think you're willing to hear them out. They're going to be shocked. If they think that you're just going to, you know, reject them or... Um, you know, have a go at them, argue with them or whatever, they're in for a shot because Aries, your energy towards them is actually quite lovely. So I think you would hear them out. Alright, that's your daily.